Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. See? That's what I'm talking about. Hands free flying. Aerobatics button and hit the aileron. See how beautiful it does it. Alright, let's chase the enemy. Da 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 ra da 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 ra da 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 Assalamu alaikum and greetings. Ali Shamo here. Welcome to more RC video reviews. If you are a Warbirds fan like I am and I love P-51 Mustang RC airplane that you're gonna simply love this Ishin Mini P-51 Mustang RC plane. I have had many RC P-51 Mustang planes in various sizes but I can tell you and very honestly this is one of the best one of the most fun mini RC P-51 Mustang plane that you will ever put your hands on. I'm not just saying it right after taking the outside box. Behind this statement, a couple of days of fun-filled flights experience is talking. Now let me introduce the plane to you. Ishin Mini P-51 Mustang comes complete ready to fly in the box. You have a radio control, okay? You have a P-51 Mustang Mini RC airplane. You do have accessories and a spare propellers. A battery charger with a USB and two 3.7 volts batteries. Let's focus on the plane. We'll talk about the radio later. First off, the beautiful, authentic, scaled looks on this plane. You are simply gonna love the looks and the scaled details that they have put on it, including these little, little guns right here. This is a complete four channel plane. The motor is a geared motor and honestly speaking, it makes some very nice sound like a radial engine which is very hard to hear but when the plane is closer you can hear it okay it's very quiet plane by the way despite of having the geared motor it's very very quiet their engine scale details here the engine exhaust scale details here okay uh, it's a dragger wheel all right it's running a single servo to control two ailerons and obviously two servos inside for elevator and rudder the airplane has a built-in gyro and that is the best thing. It has a built-in gyro and that is why it's absolutely very, very stable and very, very beginner friendly. Yes, it is definitely very beginner friendly. And that is why I said this is one of the best and most stable Mini P-51s that you will ever put your hands on. Let me give you an introduction of the radio control. It's a full-fledged, I believe, six-channel radio control. It has an X uh, switch here which switches the plane from expert that is no stabilization uh, mid stabilization you can pull some aerobatics and beginner mode for beginners to fly you can increase the throttle a bit and press this button and then move the stick aileron to right or elevator down to perform rolls and loops auto aerobatics while the plane is in stabilized mode and that is one of the best features also and that is again another best feature here because Within the stabilized mode, beginners can enjoy doing the aerobatics. Now, question is how well it flies without any stabilization. Is it stable? Well, I'll say yes, it does fly very well without any stabilization. Nice, agile, and sporty performance. But still, you can keep it in mid and then perform aerobatics, which is safer. Enough said. Let's fly it and let's see how it goes. Time to fly. This little P-51 does have landing gear, but not suitable for grass. Okay, just for nice smooth surface. Let's put in the battery, lock the battery bay, put it back on its feet. Stabilization is on and you're ready to go. See, it's just that easy. So I'm just going to put it on uh, beginner mode. I'm going to take it off. take off see how stable it is that's what I'm talking about and at the same time very nice and agile radio has uh, trims so you can basically set trims on the airplane and make it go absolutely hands-free see that's what I'm talking about hands-free flying so to say in beginner mode it gives beginners a lot of leverage and a lot of fun time because it makes I mean it takes care of flying all by itself beginners just need to steer it we have enemy in the air da 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 ra da 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 ra da da ra 
all right now I'm switching it in mid mode the stabilization is still on you can see plane auto levels all right but I can actually pull loop if I want in the mid mode so here we go bring it closer I'm gonna pull a manual loop see that's a manual loop but if you want to do roll you have to bring it at a good altitude because it tends to dive a little on roll then press the aerobatics button and hit the aileron see how beautiful it does it once you press the aerobatic button you will hear the beep okay see that's what happened when you do it on closer to ground basically the propeller is very easy to fit back it's a kind of mechanism that puts the propeller out upon crashing and saves the motor from braking awesome I actually like it so let's fly it and this time we'll do the aerobatics properly this time at good altitude take off nice and beautiful switching to mid mode actually it should do the aerobatics in beginner mode as well so let's give it a try I'm gonna go a little higher yeah it does it does in beginner mode also it does the aerobatics so that was a beautiful roll there now I'm coming for a loop wow that was beautiful awesome loop what happens if you have low throttle and you pull a loop <laughs> it's actually started hovering <laughs> sweet I like it I mean beginners can pull aerobatics anytime they want just make sure you have throttle at a higher position and for rolls you have a good altitude for loop it doesn't matter much but still I will suggest have a good altitude and you can pull sweet aerobatics what I'm gonna do now is uh, switch to total manual mode all right now this is total manual mode there is no stabilization active and the plane still flies is still controllable much more controllable uh, out of my expectation I was expecting that it will be really very difficult to control with no stabilization but the way I can control it it flies nice and smooth though a little bit more agile but it shows the amount of control you have on it the stability it has it shows that it is a very good airframe design of p51 see I'm still flying in manual mode and I can pull aerobatics oh <laughs> I didn't touch that plane <laughs> I can pull aerobatics manually now <laughs> that plane has two propellers could have shredded my <laughs> p51 so to say yes in manual mode you can actually practice your skills what you learn to fly with the stabilized mode and you know move on to bigger planes but this is definitely one airplane one mini p51 Mustang that is so much fun to fly so much fun to fly that you will not give it up anytime soon just like any other planes this little plane is very very easy to carry I can even carry it in my motorbike tank electric motorbike storage tank come to the field and enjoy flying it anytime I want and basically if you have a car just toss it anywhere in the car and you can f have fun flying it anywhere let's land and see how the landing goes sweet beautiful landing that was nice can you hand launch obviously you can all right so to hand launch obviously increase the throttle and just throw the plane in the air basically just leave it and it goes itself and this absolutely a fun plane I can tell you I love p51 Mustangs and having to have this mini p51 Mustang that flies this 
beautiful and this is stable the convenience of carrying it anywhere you want even on a motorbike this is something I really love this p51 Mustang and one more thing that you're noticing is that I haven't changed the battery 360 milliamp 3.6 volt battery I was going to hit that plane again I'm still flying it I mean it has been yeah many many minutes and it's still flying so nice and superb you know that's what I do nowadays I bring in my chair when I'm bored of FPV quads and drones I bring my chair two batteries with p51 Mustang this mini Ishin p51 Mustang and I actually have fun for 20 minutes or more flying it around Wow <laughs> I can even bring a field battery charger charge the batteries very quickly and have fun flying it all right let's chase the enemy that enemy is really fast <laughs> okay let's bring it down dive dive in the manual mode yeah in the manual mode you can do this like you go up and pull a loop and a roll okay battery run out battery run out <laughs> and my drag reveal came out Ow! but hey these two crashes will actually show you that this plane is really durable feel free to crash it it doesn't break so fixing the dragger wheel just like this all right push it more just make sure it doesn't come out adjust the landing gears there you go your plane is ready for another flight You know what to do. Hit that like button. It's right there. I know you can do it. Oh, while you're at it, also hit the subscribe button. Right there. Come on, don't be shy. Just hit it. Thank you very much for all your support towards my work that I post regular and fresh content on my channel just for you. Hit that like button. Right there.